I'm going to continue showing my origami model. So this, as you see, is something like a top. And it truly does spin. Oops. Let's see, it really spins, but not for a long time. Um, and now this looks like a um, fortune teller or cootie catcher, but it is not. Uh, see, there's no caps. And it is a flaming one or a shooting one. Shooting cootie catcher, but on the title it says flaming. So, flaming. Flaming cootie catcher. And then I want to show you the, um, the um, kinetic box. This is um, a variation of the star box, not designed by me, but it is a star box. Um, it is a variation. It's a kinetic toy number one. And it is also a, um, it is also a star number two. Number three is, um, I think it's, uh, I think it's something like, it's a loud something. It's a loud something, I forgot, but but um yeah it's allowed something i think it's something like like it doesn't really make noise for me because i think it's so old a little old now here comes a super duper duper complex model i used this out of um i think six in six inch of foil origami foil and this is a working nail clipper see and blades and then usually they have those things that you can um rough your nails on to make it round and then you just slide this thing out and then you can rough your nails uh, for my nail clipper my real one it's here and here but for this origami model it's here so this is seriously hard and then there's this bat flicker um i didn't do it completely because it was so hard but i came up with this bat shape when I just stop in the middle of it. Um, it's still pretty cool, but it can't flick. So, um. And then, this is from eight sheets. It's impossible, I think, almost from one sheet. But it's like this. Wait for a little while until, um. Okay, yes. See? It can go like this. See on the bottom, it looks like this. And then it's a cake. See, one piece of cake, two piece, three piece, four piece, five piece, six piece, seven piece, eight piece. But this is, um, you can take it apart by sliding these, but I don't want to. I, it took a hard time for me to do that. And then this is super easy, a smiley face cute dude. It smiles at you, it likes you. And then here is a, um, it's also a variation of the star box. The, um, the points of the star just tucked in into this pocket. So it's basically the um, traditional star box, but it's just tucked in here. And it can also hold things. And here's a peace sign. Also pretty easy, but I teared here because I didn't know what he was doing. It's a black peace sign. I didn't color it. And then there's a dragon thing. It looks like a kite. But then, here's what happens. Yar! Whoa. I broke it, I think. Whoa. Yar! Whoa, I did it. It's a dragon. A talking dragon. This is also from Two Sheets. It's a, a medallion. Like, like you can, um, there is, um, there's supposed, usually, um, there's that string there, and can you, like, hang on your neck? In the first place. And then there's a chicken. The chicken pecks. It likes to pick. Get it? Well, I ripped it, so it doesn't pick very good. And then there's the spinner. It can't spin always because maybe I can make a mistake, but it's supposed to be a finger spinner. Oops. But it's supposed to spin. I'll try again. See? You can fling off your hand. And there's that. I'm going to 
post this channel on YouTube, so YouTube. Silly joke. Now there's a boat. I think it's traditional. What? It's a boat. It's a boat. It's a very simple boat. And then there's this thing. A random pop-up. I don't know what it is, but it's a pop-up. See? When you pop it up. White here, orange here. White handle, orange handle. The white part's here and the orange part's here. Cool, right? And there's a turtle. The turtle is at, the turtle is out of a book and um it's paper. I took a paper out of it because they include it and the, the, they also include the design. This is sort of like plastic paper or waterproof. So um I did try putting it in water but the turtle. And it can hide it. Thing in. Do, 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 do. Now it's only a shell. Get out, turtle. Okay, the turtle's out. See, it follows my commands. And then this guy is my friend. Do you know why? See? This, right? It likes me. And when you do here, it also stays on, meaning it likes me because it, it stays on to me. Agree? And then, um, 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 if I have something, um, if my pinky is a pencil, it can be a container. But if I have a real pencil, it can just go in this hole. But I'm just pretending my pinky is it. And then there's a snake. Super duper easy, but I don't have very precise food, so it came out looking rather ugly. And then, last time I showed you, um, that, um, uh, the, um, flaming cootie catcher, that's the traditional fortune teller. Or, yeah. Get it? Well, there's a game about it. I, I forgot it. This fish can do many things, such as swim, or this side. I colored on the eyes if you can see stuff. It can swim. And then it's also supposed to talk somehow. I think it's like this. Yeah. See? I think it's like this. I think I forgot somehow. But see, it goes like talk, 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 talk. But you have to cut it in half. Super easy, it's a fish face like this. And you fold it in half, done. And then, I think all of, and a lot of you guys know what Mario is, like the Mario video game. And then, um, last, last, the last video I made um, showed Mario and um, do something, I still forgot the name. And then now I folded Toad with Mushroom Head. Well, he's supposed to have it. And then there's what I call the bendy and stretchy strip. I'm like, look at this. Check out this, it can even twist. Oh my God, right? It can even eat you. Okay, it's Bendy Strip. Bye bye. And then, I think you guys know Pokemon Go, so Charmander is to the rescue. I use Fire Tail or something. And then there's um uh, um 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 was there's the bug thing um Hercules Beetle. Um, it's a Hercules Beetle. Um, I don't know why it doesn't include the legs, but I'll show you another version that includes the legs and is from one sheet. This is from two sheets. I'll just show it later. But that one's harder. This one's super easy. I use tape to tape it on. It can eat you. No legs. And then there's another beetle. I don't know it. But it's not the Hercules beetle. It's from one sheet of paper, but not the Hercules beetle. See? It still has no legs, so it can't move. See? And when I shout at it, move! See? It doesn't budge. Unless if you pick it up. And then there's the Hercules Beetle. Um, I folded two. First one, second one. It's from one sheet this time, okay? It's from one sheet, but it's a lot, lot, lot harder. There's even legs. Legs, legs, legs. This one is so horrible because it's my first time. This one is so awesome because it's my second time. 
And then, I think, since right now it's quarantine for me, maybe not for you, but a lot of people, and then, so, I think a lot of you guys use class as Zoom. And it's a flicker. See? See? It flies. It flies rather far. Well, if I make a mistake at flicking it, sorry, but it should fly. Ooh. Oh, it flew in that box. Well, here is a super simple boat. It's a swan boat. It's a crane boat. And it also flaps when you, when you squish it and it suffers. Poor little crane. And it's a talking alien. Here's how it works. It's obvious it can talk. And it's also a flicker. Oh, whoa, whoa. I'm gonna flick it. Now there's the snake, another version. Well, can't do anything good. And then there's a froggy. It can talk when you do this, see? But when it's angry, here's what happens. Get it? Its eye pops out. It can, when it's mad, super mad, it'll hurt you. Punch, punch, punch. And then, here's the flasher. I failed on it, but I did half of it. It's supposed to come completely into a square box. Here's what I came up with. I told you I failed half of it. And then, here's what happens. It's a tent. Well, hat. I folded this. And then, again, I folded Charmander. So, of course, I folded a very popular one. It's the yellow mouse. When I introduce Pikachu. I use Iron Tail. I'm sure it's something. No, since there's no face, um, when you show under a light, um, um, when you show under a light, something, um, it happens, like, to, um, show its face, but since I'm not near a light, um, I can't do it, unless if I have a lamp over here and drag it over and, no, oh, it has a face, but, see, if you turn it over, you can see it, mouth, and then here are the eyes, eyes, well, they're invisible here because it's blocking. But if you show a light, they'll be there. Last of all, well, very close to last of all, super complex model. A person wearing glasses with headphones from one sheet of paper and no tape. It's super hard. I got mixed up. See? Um, um, it's slanted. It has a big hole in it. Super hard. But since I don't get it, I just taped it. The headphones are together. But it's too hard. It's too small. And now here's the model's me design, or sometimes me is half designed. This sock um is super horrible because I designed it. Well, um, my mom says it good because I designed it. And um, for as as super bored, I asked my sister um what should I fold. She said. A stinky sock with stink fumes. See, um, there's the stinkiness. Stinky, stinky. It doesn't really look like one, but stink, stink, stink. It's what I call the sock with stink fumes. And then another model I designed, but half I designed. So um, I did make the things to bend in, but I did the thing to make it chomp. See, um, this is super hard, so I'm just gonna go closer. Um, see, when you open it, it opens right, but when you do it more, it closes up. And when you do this, it snaps back. Opens up, closes. Agree? Snaps back. Most people say it only opens, but. Now here's another model, only me did that. Well, half. The legs were someone else and the head was um, me. Well, here's the outfit. I taped it. It's supposed to be bouncing here, but I can't bounce it. I'm bad at bouncing, so I decide tape. 
And then here's what I came up with. The elephant that stands. And when he nudges his head, falls. So, hope you enjoyed this video. And if you like it, please give it a like. Bye-bye.